Hello there and welcome yourself in. I hope this practice can allow stimulation and regulation within your system to support your digestion. Now wherever you are in your day, meet me in a seated position. Cross your legs, sit up tall, and let's just begin to bring the body into a deeper state of relaxation. Normally, this is facilitated by a deep, steady emphasis on your exhalation. So take a big breath in with me, fill all the way up. And then from the mouth, breathe out. Let's do that again. Inhale, you fill, you wake the belly, the chest, the throat. Exhale, you empty, 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 empty. One more. Hmm. Now let your breath find its own perfect rhythm. But you're not trying to control the breath too much. Instead, you're allowing the breath to just take the reins. Now, start to just gently shift yourself all the way forwards, my love. Unravel your legs. Come into all fours. Let's drop the belly down. So soften the contracting and the tightening and facilitate this releasing. Lift your chest. And then let's round the backs. Now we counteract this shape. We start to tuck the chin in. The tailbone draws under, but you can still keep your belly soft. Organizing just a little bit of moving through the internal system. Breathe in, come back into that first position. Breathe out and round into your back. You can always linger a little longer. You can hang out in the stretch, in the unwinding and unraveling. And then let's unravel this shape a little more. So you'll come into your cow position as you breathe in. And then as we breathe out, we'll round into the back. So let the chin come in again. But this time, you can think about sending your hips back towards your heels. Stretch your hands further forwards. And then let's just sink and link the breath through those simple movements. So roll yourself forwards as you breathe in. Arch your spine as you breathe out. And then send the hips back. So there's a smoothness to the movement. Inhale brings you forwards. Exhale, you arch the spine and send the hips all the way back. Okay, let's go for one more. Breathe in forwards. Breathe out and push in all the way back. Now this time, as you inhale, you just shift and shuffle back into that rounded spine. And then as you exhale, let's realign in downward facing dog. You can send your heels back, press your hands forwards, let the head go. And then walk your toes in. You come to stand, come to step towards the top of the mat. Take your hands forwards, lengthen out your back body and then fold into yourself, create a little bit more space. Now let's lift all the way up and reach the hands out and up. Breathe in. As you breathe out, bring the hands in. Calm your system down. Bring one hand to heart, one hand to belly. And with the hands on the body, feel the feedback of you. Listen, tune, tap into you. Breathe into you. Breathe out. Now with your next breath in, take your arms out and up. Clear the space around you. 
as you exhale, fold into you. Halfway lift through your back. Now as you exhale, you'll step your right foot back and then your left foot come into a high plank and then lower into low plank. Roll over the toes, pull your chest upwards, high cobra, exhale, downward facing dog. From downward facing dog, you can begin to send your right leg all the way back behind you. What goes up must come down, step the right foot in between your hands. Now lower your left knee and lift up your right arm. Let's twist from the navel center. Twist and turn and churn. Send the right hand back. See if you can grab hold of your left foot. Rotate your chest further open and roll your right shoulder away from your ear. Breathe in. Release the shape. Breathe out. Take the hands down. Pick up your left knee. And then step the left foot forwards gracefully. Fold forwards. Halfway lift. Realign the back. Exhale, fold. Drop the skull. How soft, how slow can you move? Come all the way up. Weaving gentility in through your circuitry. As you breathe out, take the hands all the way out. Cleaning the sleigh, cleaning your palate. Halfway lift. Breathe in. As you breathe out, let's reverse. We're just going to step the left foot back, lower the knee. Left hand under the shoulder, right arm reaches up like an arrow. Send it all the way back like a dagger. And fire. Take hold of the foot. Draw the heel in closer towards the glute. Now for this second round, you might be able to drop onto your left forearm. Take the twist a little deeper. Draw the left hand towards the right ankle and then let the right knee roll out. Hands will come all the way back under the shoulders. Pick up your back knee and step into downward facing dog gracefully. Now the left leg goes back to bring it all the way forwards. Drop the right knee down and lift up your left arm. The arm goes back and you try to grab hold of the foot as you bend that back knee. Good, breathe into it. Let the breath meet your stomach muscles. Let it relax them, unknot them, unpack them. Now release the gripping, the binding, take the hands down, pick up the right knee and step the right foot forwards, fold forwards, halfway, and then release something. Rise all the way up, breathe in. Fold all the way down, breathe out. Halfway lift as you inhale. We reverse as you exhale. Send the right leg back. The second time we approach the shape, drop the knee, lift the left arm, send the arm back, cup hold of the foot. And if it's in your flexibility and capacity, lower the right elbow. Bring the hand to cup hold of the left ankle and let the knee draw out as you roll onto the outer edge of the left foot. Breathe in, breathe out. And start to release the shape. Gather your hands down, pick yourself up. Come all the way back into downward facing dog. And then from down dog, roll yourself all the way forwards. Lower high plank to low plank, strengthen the internal system, up dog, into downward facing dog. Breathe in, breathe out. Now we will move with the breath to encourage some movement within. 
Send the right leg back as you breathe in. Step the right foot forwards as you breathe out. Drop the left knee, reach your right arm up, and then shoot the hand back. Send the arm forwards and down. Pick up your left knee, step the left foot forwards. Halfway lift, re-anchor in the breath. Exhale, fold. Inhale, come all the way to stand, lift up your arms. As you exhale, fold yourself forwards and down. Inhale, halfway lift. As you exhale, step the left foot back, lower the knee, lift up your right arm, shoot it on back, bend the knee, cut hold of the foot, breathe in. Reach the arm forwards and down, breathe out, downward facing dog, your left leg goes back as you inhale. As you exhale, your left foot transitions forwards, drop the back knee, lift up your left arm, send the arm back, inhale, just stroke the foot. Exhale, hand comes forwards and down, right foot steps forwards, halfway lift, breathe in, forward and breathe out. Come all the way to stand, lift up, 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 hands up. And then as you exhale, come all the way back down. Halfway lift, inhale. Your right leg moves back as you exhale. Drop the knee, lift up the left arm. Reach the hand back to grab hold of the foot. Take a breath in. As you breathe out, release, hand down, feet together, downward facing dog. One last roll into a high plank. Lower yourself down, lift yourself up, reset in downward facing dog. Breathe in. Drop to the knees, breathe out, push the hips to the heels, stack your spine, bring your hands to your thighs, close the eyes, and just notice if anything feels a little different. Breathe in, breathe out. Now let's just shift the hips over to one side. Send the legs forwards, roll onto your back. We'll take a final twist to really just dissipate anything that might be lingering within the body. Pull the right knee in and then send it over to the left. Supine twist. Reach your right arm out. Try to soften through your body, so just notice if there are any parts of you that are holding or tightening, clenching, resisting, and see if you can facilitate this action of just dropping. Drop through the physical. Let it relax the internal. Breathe in. Breathe out. Now release the right leg all the way back out. Start to draw the left knee in towards the chest. Give it a squeeze in. And then send the knee over the body. Extend your left arm out. Twisting is a real great way to release toxicity. Anything that you have been eating, ingesting, drinking, let things start to move through and out your system. Let things move through and out. Start to stretch your legs all the way back out. Release the legs, release your arms, soften through your physical form. Close your eyes and give yourself a moment to relax, to release, to restore.
start to bring your legs back into your chest with your next breath in. Breathe out. Roll yourself all the way up in towards a sea where you can allow your hands to meet right at the center of your chest. Bowing in and allowing this bow to be the symbol of the completion of this practice. Namaste.